Okay. So, I'm not streaming this time. I'm going to record. I'm going to play a game called Dust, an Elysian tale recommended to me by a friend. We are launching this game. Oh! It's on the wrong screen. Oops. Here, hang on. Help and options. Settings. This will be off. Here. Full screen on. I can't adjust it anymore. Ah, ah! Oh no! This is amazing. Uh, Alright. Let's try that again. Alright, here we go. Okay, I'm gonna launch it over there again. Even though I don't want to. Settings. Let's do that. Off. There we go. Okay. Now I move this guy over here. Set the full screen back on. On. Perfect. There we go. All right. Game is exactly where I want it now. Control method. Okay. Slot one. Normal. Head to hardcore. And go through normal. Our world has fallen to fade. Its great works long since complete. Its storied civilizations long since fallen to dust. The greatest legends of Elysium long since forgotten. What was once a land of promise has fallen to the ravages of war. And it was in this, our most desperate hour, that the greatest of Elysian tales began. The lone warrior stood against an army, slashing his way through all who opposed him. The mob stood no chance, and the soldier showed no mercy. But despite his victories, his skills, his ruthlessness. The valiant soldier would perish on this day. Not to the mob, but to a single child. Dust. Dust. Arise. Summoned? Summoned? How? For what purpose? That I do not know. But we shall learn in time. Now rise and claim the blade of Ara. Guardian 
of this sword. No offense, but aren't you a bit, well, small? For a guardian, I mean. Hey, I just look after that thing. After 200 years, nobody expects the sword to just fly off and start, you know, talking. I'm kind of wishing somebody told me this was part of the job description. Or maybe they did, and I just wasn't paying attention. Yeah, that happens sometimes. I'm sorry, I think I misheard before. You said your name was Fidget? Hey, this isn't about me. You're the one who's got my sword. How about you tell me your name? I'm... Uh... Calm yourself, Fidget. His name is Dust. And he is the one who woke me from my slumber. So, Fidget, then? That's me. And you're... Dust? It would seem that way, though I can't recall that name. So, what is this sword? I am the Blade of Ara, and you, Dust, are my fated sword bearer. Yes, well, that's all great and everything, but I think it's about time I got this sword back to the clan. I can't let you just leave with this sword, Fidget. Right now, it's the only thing that knows who I am. I don't even know how I got here. Hmm. Well, then you leave me no choice. I... I, I challenge you! The winner gets the sword! Well, I... All right, all right, you win. But don't think I'm leaving empty-handed. I'm coming with you. But, um, I really need the sword back when you're done doing... You know, whatever it is you're doing. What exactly am I doing, Hara? The answers you seek lie to the east. There is a path through the glade that leads down the mountainside. And from there you will find a village. That is your first step. Then will you give me the sword? I really need to get it back home before anyone notices it's uh, gone. When I find out just what it is I'm supposed to do with it, it's all yours, Fidget. Come on, let's go. I don't even have any voice acting to do in this game. Healing item for the current slot. Could be used in game with left bumper. No content sensitive controls. Context sensitive. Bottom of each screen for additional options. Open 
small glade in the mountains with no memory of your past. The ancient magical blade, Aha, this guardian fidget, I have joined you. Your travels the east is your own. Character. I rolled poorly this round. <laughs> it's alright. Okay, cool. Hmm. What is it, Fidget? Well, my kind has what you'd call a sixth sense, and there's something just ahead. Magic beyond our comprehension. Only way to reclaim these lost treasures is to use the magically attuned key string about our world. I only hope there is enough time to free them all. I collected a key. Mysterious wall chicken. All right, we found a chest. Correction, we found a locked chest. Well, what are you waiting for? Smash it open. That would be unwise, Dust. These chests are protected by arcane locks from the last era, and are well beyond my capabilities. I suppose we'll need a key, then. But I already found one. Rejuvenate the life of fallen soldiers. Cool. Thus far. No, no! Mash the buttons! Do something! Mash the buttons? imbued therein. Uh, hello? Monsters? Is that why I summoned you? To control this power? 
It is unlikely, Dust, that I would awaken from my slumber for such selfish reasons. There is a village beyond these woods. Perhaps finding it will aid in restoring your memories. And then we'll be in the clear, right? No more monsters? Fidget, I think things are about to get a whole lot worse. <sighs> and to think, this morning started off so well. At least take these feeble fruits. Something tells me you're going to need them. Come through a save monu monument. I'll save your progress.
finest lumber, some pap fabric. On we go. Hold here, Dust. You have unlocked a new ability. Bear witness to the dust storm. I like it. Hold the secondary attack to perform the dust storm. But beware, skilled as you may be, you cannot maintain the storm for long without hurting yourself. In that case, maybe I can help. If you press the super ballistic fidget action button of power, I'll perform an attack <laughs> so spectacularly awesome that it'll produce emotions you didn't even know existed. Please contain yourself as I demonstrate. <gasps> That was, uh, very pretty. Hmm. Well, maybe I'll just keep the rest of my repertoire to myself. I'm sorry, Fidget. I'm sure it'll come in handy somehow. Actually, Dust, between the three of us, this could be quite useful. The Dust Storm can manipulate Fidget's projectile into a more powerful attack. Observe. <laughs> My power, it'll use up a bit of energy meter. You can recharge the meter with melee combos. Yes, Dust. Between your combos and Fidget's own powers, you can achieve a higher hit chain, which will yield bonus experience after each battle. However, if you are struck by an enemy, the chain will be broken, and you will lose your bonus experience. All right, I think I understand. If this is all too much for you, you can check out the help screen via- Thanks, Fidget. I'll take a look if I'm ever in trouble. Okay, so it's Yeah, sure, we'll do it 
attack first. The ring that serves no purpose. six of them, all armed to the teeth and closing in fast. I'd made it to Archer's Pass, but with my arrow in my leg, they caught up with me at the headless statue. Surrounded, desperate, and nowhere else to go, I climbed up to the hand and made a leap of faith. <laughs> Tell me. Oh, silly me. I seem to have dropped all my detailed maps and navigational equipment chasing after a crazy flying sword. I'm sorry I got you mixed up in this fidget. Well, you should be. Digging my sword, getting me in trouble. You know, now that I think about it, this isn't the first time I've seen this view. I've stood here before, in this very spot. Then perhaps you recognize the village at the base of these cliffs? It's hard to make out from here. We'll need to drop down to the valley floor if we want to get any closer. Very well. Proceed as you wish, Dust.
Whatever it is, it's got glowing evil eyes of evil. A merchant lies in wait. Do not let his appearance frighten you. I sense he only wishes to assist in our journey. Psh, I wasn't frightened. Just surprised at the uh, savings. <laughs> Come on, let's talk to him. I've been expecting you, stranger. Who are you? Merely a friend with many wares for sale. Shall we conduct business? Sure. Business. We can do that conduct. Before you leave, might I propose an offer? That would depend on the offer. If I may be so bold, you are not prepared for the journey ahead. I, however, can offer assistance. Please, accept this blueprint as a gift. Should you find a blacksmith and the necessary materials, they may be able to craft the item for you. I can offer you materials as well, though, I'm not entirely sure what materials this land deems of value. I am not from around here, as I'm sure you've guessed by now. Once you've sold me a new material type, I will be able to restock my store with it. As for your reward, I will pay you a bonus for the first new material you sell me. Ah, he'll buy them at a high price. I... well, yes. Yes, I will. Thank you. Watch your back, my friend.
Not a problem at all. Stand back. All right, I've got it. Wait, no. Oh. Having some trouble there? Yeah, I don't know. I just can't get a good enough grip. Aw, you're just trying to show off. That's sweet. Don't worry about it. I'm sure there's a way to get up there. We'll just come back later. like we're heading in the right direction. Be on your guard, Dust. I sense a powerful foe ahead of you. Don't worry, Dust. I'll be behind you every step of the way. Way behind. Oh, she's so cute. <laughs> ah, it's another one of those spiky slime things! Their persistence will give them that. Much as I pity this corrupted beast, now might be a good time to demonstrate the parry technique. Allow it to strike. Hey, you dazed it! Attack and hold the button at the moment of the enemy strike, and you will parry their attack, opening them up for a counterattack. Timing is crucial, and you must be facing your opponent. And as you can see, a successful parry may also daze your opponent temporarily. Now, I see somebody over there. Ask them if they've got anything to eat. We're in a bit of a hurry, Fidget. Don't worry, I'll feed you later. Hey, I'm not a pet! But, uh, I would appreciate that. Thanks. Oh, you surprised me there. Don't get many travelers this far out of town. Sorry about that. It's nice to finally meet a friendly face. So we're getting closer to the village then? You mean Aurora Village? Yes, it's just beyond those fields to the east. And I think you might be just in time. What do you mean? The monster attacks down there have been getting worse. Right before you showed up, I'd swear I heard somebody shouting. She's right, Dust. I can hear somebody calling for help further down the path. Let's get going. Yes, please hurry. Be careful. Save point. Oh, I'm fucked. I'm so dead. Don't worry. 
worry. I think I can handle it. Exercise all you've learned, Dust. Send these foul creatures from this existence. Master, and none too soon. Bah, they weren't so tough. I could probably take on another four or five of them. Yeah, you know, right. If I had to. And this was the... <laughs> oh, thank you so much. What happened here? I, I don't know. We were out here checking the fields when those giants attacked. We've been having a lot of problems with smaller beasts, but this is the first time a giant has ever come this close to the village. Then the first step of your journey is near its end, Dust. The village lies just ahead. Yes, we arrived. That's great. But what now? That has not yet been revealed to me. These people are safe, and that is what is important. Let us continue onward. Will you 
two be all right? <clears throat> yes. I just need a moment to rest. I'm not sure how you did it, but you took down three giants single-handedly. Not a problem. That's what we do. Bringing justice to the weak and defenseless. Hey! Who are you calling weak? <laughs> We're still a little shook up, but I think we'll be fine. I just need to sit here for a while. <laughs> My leg still hurts. You should get to safety when you can. I cleared out quite a few monsters on the way in, but you never know when they'll be back. Did one of those monsters hurt you? Well, I mean, not exactly. This old lug twisted his ankle running away from those monsters. Nice of you to stick around to protect your poor old wife. I was running to get help. Yeah, lots of help in the tool shed, I'm sure. What, you got a little army hiding in there? Maybe I should go. Oh, no, please don't get the wrong idea. I still love my husband, even if he is a coward. Oh, goodness. Bah! Oh, by yourself. Scene. Chapter one. Destiny. Oh, I like. So we finally finished the intro mission. <laughs> I think I'll stop here. I'm tempted to. Let's. Aurora Village. Very Japanese. Or Chinese. Hello. Hold it right there. Are they gone? I don't hear anything. If you're referring to the giants, I took care of them. They're dead? Yep. Thoroughly expired. They were no match for us. There's an older couple back there that could use some help, though. That must have been Oneida and her husband, Gian. Thank you. We'll send help right away. So you're saying you just happened to show up at the right time, huh? I suppose. <laughs> Interesting coincidence. If you're suggesting I had something to do with this attack... Whoa, whoa, take it easy. I, I have to apologize for my big friend Caleb here. We're just a little overwhelmed is all. What's been happening here? I guess you missed the endless hordes of bloodthirsty monsters on your way in? They used to stay in the mountains, away from the village. Now they're attacking us on a daily basis. No one's been hurt yet. Uh, at least not until today. If giants are showing up near Oneida's farm, things are far worse than we thought. Speaking of which, where exactly do you come from? There's nothing west of here except crazy old Korra. We're, uh... Prospectors! We are prospectors! And we're out on an excavation to find, uh, ore deposits in the mountains! You know, gold, silver, um... Mingonite? <laughs> Prospectors, eh? You're certainly well armed for the job. Like you said, there are a lot of monsters out there. <sighs> well, we're indebted to you either way, so go on through. But I'm watching the two of you. Please, make yourselves at home. Uh, my name is Bean. There's not much here, Bean. but we do have a merchant if you need supplies. Bean. Thank you. Oh, we'll awesome. be on our way then. I'm gonna stop here. Uh, I like this game. It's a cute game. And it's fun. It's challenging. I'll play some more tomorrow, I think. I'll upload this straight to YouTube. Or friend fam. Alright, bye. Bye. Ah! Well, not what I wanted to do.